Segmenting your data lets you investigate your audience and its behavior based on specific attributes. You can apply broad attributes like new and returning users, or you can apply more narrow attributes like users from a particular geographic region who arrived to be a specific campaign and who used a specific technology to interact with your content. You can evaluate behavior from nearly any point of view. Previously in analytics, you could evaluate only visit-based behavior, that is, anything that users did within the time frame of a single visit. For example, the goal someone completed during a visit or the revenue someone generated during a visit. With the new Segment Builder, you can also evaluate cumulative behavior across all visits in a date range, up to 90 days. For example, all the goals a user completed in a week, or all the revenue a user generated in a month, regardless of the number of visits involved. By looking beyond isolated behavior, did anyone spend more than $25 during a visit, to evaluate cumulative behavior, did anyone spend more than $100 during the past month, you can better understand and invest in your high-value users. To use the new Segment Builder, at the top of one of your reports, under the title, click the arrow to open a list of segments that includes all the default segments that come pre-built with Analytics, along with all of your custom segments. To apply existing segments to your reports, click the Segment Labels or drag them to the empty fields at the top. Click Apply to update the report with the data for the segments you selected. To create a new segment, click the arrow to open the list of existing segments, then click Create New Segment. Enter a name for the segment. Use the upper section to create basic filters. Use the lower section to create advanced filters. Basic filters compare dimensions and metrics to values you enter. For example, Operating System Contains Android or revenue per user is greater than 10. Advanced filters let you create conditions and sequences. Conditions not only compare dimensions and metrics to values you enter, but also let you include AND and OR statements. For example, operating system contains Android AND revenue is greater than 10. Sequences let you define the sequence of user behavior. For example, page A is followed by page B. You can define a sequence to occur within a single visit or to occur over any number of visits within a date range. In addition, you can define the sequence steps to occur at any time after one another or immediately after one another. A segment can include multiple basic and advanced filters. Build segments to identify specific elements of your audience that you want to analyze. For example, users from Los Angeles who downloaded your shopping app on a Galaxy Nexus. Apply those segments to your reports to see the data associated with those behaviors. For example, did the users who downloaded the shopping app spend more money than users who did not? The new segments gives you the ability to analyze virtually any aspect of your audience so you can understand and capitalize on that behavior.